How are you with integrals? It's the Mad Guy Steve. Evaluate the integral of x squared to dx to dx. So we use integration by parts, okay, which says I want to rewrite this as u dv, okay. And so what I choose for my u is usually we usually at to help us choose log inverse trig, algebraic trig, and then exponential. So here we have an algebraic and an exponential, and so our u we would say it would be the algebraic. In other words, x squared and dv would be e to the x dx. And now we have to fill in this box, meaning, okay, derive down, integrate up. So if u is x squared, then du is 2x dx. If dv is e to the x dx, then v would be e to the x. So derive down, integrate up. So substituting those in, we get this is the integral of our x squared, which is u, and then our e to the x dx, which is dv. And the integral of u dv by parts is uv minus the integral of v du. In other words, ultraviolet voodoo, ultraviolet voodoo. So this becomes, okay, u times v, which is x squared times e to the x minus the integral of v du, meaning e to the x times the 2x dx. And now hopefully this integrand is a lot easier to integrate, which it is. Now for this one, we have to use by parts again. So this time we'll let u be x and then dv be e to the x dx, derive down, integrate up. And so du is going to be just dx, and v is going to be e to the x. So plugging those in, we get this is x squared e to the x minus 2 of, this becomes now the integral of u dv. In other words, x squared e to the x minus 2 of these ultraviolet voodoo. uv minus the integral of v du, which is x squared e to the x minus 2 times x e to the x minus the integral of e to the x dx. So lastly, our solution So that would give me x squared e to the x minus 2 of x e to the x, and then plus 2 times the integral of e to the x, which is just e to the x. So now that we're done integrating, we put a plus c at the end. Always remember, math is everywhere.